Emojis have got a whole new set of talents in iOS 17, and you can use them in really exciting and innovative new ways. If I go into a message thread like this one, you all know you can send an emoji as a text message just like normal, but what you can do now is you can tap and drag the emoji from that bottom page, whether it's in the search results or just in the emoji gallery, and then you can place it anywhere you like in the conversation. That might mean you can use it as an emoji reaction to someone's message, or perhaps like in this instance where I've got a photograph, I can put some emoji on the picture and have a bit of fun and make a little playful collage. This new way of communicating using emojis makes your iPhone better than ever with iOS 17, and it's not the only thing that's changed. Lots of these updates are quite hidden and quite hard to discover, but luckily I've made a playlist on the end screen that you can check out now, and then you'll be up to date on iOS 17. And make sure you subscribe down below to my channel if you want more iPhone tips on your YouTube homepage, that way you won't miss anything.